I'll guide you through how to stream on Kick with OBS. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like and let's get right into this guide. We start off uh, on the Kick page. When we get here, we start off on the menu and we go to the top right here. You will see buttons uh, saying login or sign up. After you go through the login or sign up process, you can follow my steps completely. You go to your avatar, you select it and you go into the creator dashboard. Here you can find uh, most of your uh, information related to your Steam stream. You can find uh, the viewers the followers, the time life, your activity feed, your bot actions, and next you can edit your stream info by going to the top right and selecting this right here. You select this and here you can edit the title of your stream. You can say anything right here, you can write anything. Then you can add a category such as gaming, uh, live chatting, etc. Tags are not yet available, they will be coming soon. In language, you select the language that you will be speaking in your stream. And at the bottom you have 18 plus mature audiences only. You move over to the left, you go and press settings. This is the most important thing about streaming on Kick. You go to stream key, you open this up. And after you open this up, then you can go and move over to your OBS. Now I'm in my OBS, as you can see I'm using it to record. After you are done with this, you just go into the settings, you select the settings option, and you navigate down to stream. In stream, for service, you select custom. After you have selected that, you go back and you copy your stream URL, and you paste it in the server section. I have already done that. And then you go over and take your stream key, you copy it, and you paste, paste it in your stream key section. After you are done with all of this, you just go to the bottom and you press apply. And then you press OK. Now, let me minimize this. Now we can continue by setting up the other stuff in OBS. Let's go to settings again. We start off in general. Now you move in to output. Here, you saw, uh, I wouldn't mess around with the video bitrate. But uh, if you have a lower end PC, you can change it up if you know what you're doing. Now moving over to audio, use uh, a preset devices for your global audio devices. I would recommend you keep these uh, settings as they are. I use 1920 times 1080 resolution. After you are done with everything, you press apply and you press OK. Now moving on to the scenes. If you can create new scenes by pressing the plus button. And after we have, you have created a new scene, you just press OK. Then, I, I will not create any other scene because I'm recording right now. And if you want to create sources, it you press the plus button right here. And it depends what kind of source you want to add. You can add a browser source, you can add a display capture, a game capture. Let's add a display capture for this option. Uh, as you can see, uh, create new display option, press OK. You can select the display that you want right here. You can select uh, your any of I have three monitors, so I will select my main one. And you can select whether you want for it to capture your cursor. And I have already created a display to capture. And as you can see, that is it for this section right here. Adding sources is really easy. Uh, the last settings that I want to show you how to mess around with is the slider that you have on your microphone and desktop audio. When you lower and uh, make it higher, uh, it will make you sound louder or quieter. Once you set everything up, then all you need to do is go to the bottom right of OBS and tap on start streaming and you'll then be streaming to your kick. Then what you can do is go back to that uh, kick sort of dashboard and you can then go and see if your stream is coming through. If you found this useful, then please consider leaving a like. Peace.